In this video, I'm going to tell you about five things I've learned I hate about doing daily video vlogs and one thing I actually really like. Because you have to have a hook or no one's going to watch the end of your video. First thing I've learned is that producing daily video content is really tiresome. Unless you're doing vlog style, talk to the camera, stuff like this, it takes a lot of time and effort to actually plan things out, shoot things, do the editing, um, grab data, especially with astrophotography, that it gets really tiresome quickly. The second problem that exists is that I have to come up with daily content every single day. Vloggers that go on to the internet and say, what's going on today? Well, apparently NASA's paying SpaceX to land on the moon. Great, I could have done a whole video about that today, but I'd actually have to go and research everything about it and then be able to provide you really cool information. Otherwise, I'm just simply repeating, you know, what I read on Twitter, which was, Apparently NASA is paying Elon Musk to land on the moon, which if he's smart about it, he's going to basically design a Mars lander, land on the moon and go, ha ha, NASA's just paid for my Mars lander design. You know, I realize the moon is not as heavy as Mars, but if you're going to do it, why not do it all the way? And that's sort of the issue with daily vlogging. You end up talking about stuff that everyone else is talking about and it's hard to differentiate your content from everybody else. So the third thing I want to talk to you about that I absolutely test about daily video vlogs is that it's really hard to promote your video and you actually end up with people who watch your channel that unsubscribe because you're just pounding out so much content. It's very hard to stay in a really narrow niche when you have to come out with content every single day. Um, unless your niche is again, what's on the news, you end up having it where you're gonna start sort of wavering a bit. And some people that have subscribed to you, they simply just go, nope, nope, and they're gone. So my stats have not been great this month. The fourth thing I really don't like about doing daily video vlogs is that you don't get a day off. Like you have to produce content. And I have a giant list like in my little book here of things I want to film that I can't film right now because they would take two, three, maybe four days to actually produce that I simply cannot do in that 24 hour cycle. So May's going to be amazing with less content, but it'll be more amazing content. And that brings me to the fifth one. The algorithm hates me. It really, really hates me. People who don't watch at least until this far in the video, they'll watch like the first like minute or two of a five minute video are really hurting my analytics stats. And then YouTube's like, oh, okay, I guess I'm not gonna share your video out. And I'm like, I make these videos so people can watch them. I make these videos so they're helpful. When YouTube analytics gods, or whatever you wanna call them, just turn around and say, well, here's a video that you've spent time doing and they toss it, it hurts. Now, there is one thing I like about this though, and it sort of fits into number five which is the one thing I like about it is that since I'm producing this content, I'm not as attached to each video. I try to obviously produce it the same quality, content, honesty, all that good stuff. But at the end of the day, if I produce 30 videos in a month and five of them are bad, it's not the end of the world. Whereas before when I was producing one video or two videos a week, if a video did badly, I was like, that's seven days gone, bye. So that's the nice thing about doing daily video vlogs, at least for a short period of time, is you get a lot of content out, you can try a lot of new things, you can see what people really like, and you can see what people really hate it. And to try to, you know, make the content for what I want to do and make the content I want to make, but adjust that to make content I like to make and people really want to see more of. So Thanks for watching all the way to the end of the video. Please give it a like, subscribe, all that crazy YouTube stuff if you want. And uh, if you have ideas, leave them below. If you think I'm doing a really good job, great. If you're like, this vlogging thing is like detrimental to your channel and I've been sort of hovering above that unsubscribe button, let me know and let me know why so I can sort of make those changes. I have, I think, eight days left to go. So is it eight days? 12 days left to go. Oh God. Wish me luck. And thanks for watching. <laughs>